but you're looking for someone like me. Hello everyone, this is your author Sheila D and I hope you all are having a blessed day. Today I'm coming to you with another story time and this story time involves my daughter-in-law. So some years back, um, probably like around 10 p.m., 11 p.m. on this one particular night, I was being, um, as the old folks would say, fast or grown. And um, I considered this particular night to be one of my weak moments. I didn't have many of those, but, you know, hey, I'm healing. So, And um, I ended up texting my ex-boyfriend. Yes, I did say my ex-boyfriend. He and I, uh, we stayed in contact with each other um, over the years, no matter, you know, if we were in a relationship or not, you know, we were just, we just had that type of chemistry. Um, so we always stayed in touch with each other. Now, since he's deceased now, so I just want to put that in there. But anyway, this particular night, I'm just, you know, texting on my phone, just texting and texting. And uh, so I sent him this, this, I guess you would say naughty text. Um, basically just telling him what I missed and, and where I missed it, so to speak. So, you know, I did all of that and then I hit that send button. And so I'm waiting and I'm waiting for his response. And then all of a sudden I get this text that said, uh, was this message meant for me? So, you know, I'm, I panic. I'm like, oh Lord, who did I send this text to? <laughs> And I sent it to my daughter-in-law, y'all. OMG, if I could crawl under a rock and die, I would have did that that particular night. And then, y'all, she goes and shows it to my son. My son. <laughs> so I'm like thinking, oh, there's no way I could ever face them again. I don't know what I'm going to do. That's just how I felt because it was just that bad. Yes, I'm not going to say uh, in detail what I text, but it was bad. And now... <laughs> My, not only does my daughter-in-law knows what was on my mind, but my son knows. I'm like, why she had to show my son? Why she couldn't keep it between just us? But anyway, y'all, it was it was a while before I saw them again. And the more to this story is, be careful who you send a text to. Pay attention. Look, don't just send that butt. Don't just push the send button. I mean, geez, if, if I could take it back, y'all, we still laugh about that today, but talk about embarrassing. O-M-G. Well, if you guys have enjoyed this story, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. And uh, thank you so much for tuning in and, and uh, watching. And please um, comment below and let me know if you sent a text to the wrong person, a bad text, like a naughty text to, to the wrong person before. And, um, Come, you know, and then um, also, I'm sorry, um, click on my subscribe button if you haven't already. And thanks again for watching, and uh, you all have a blessed day. Mm -hmm.